we want to find the graph and then the rectangular equation for these two parametric equations right here. The thing you got to be careful about is if you notice the t squared here, so any number um, less or any number that is uh, any number less than zero is just going to take it right back up. So this equation as opposed to a normal parametric or normal equation, so negative four. So if you had zero, so it'd be, it's no matter what you do, it's always going to start out right here at uh, four, negative four, and then it's going to be linear. So you plug in one or negative one, you're going to get um, negative three, or three and, and negative, or five and negative three, and then just, it's a linear like this. Okay. So substituting this in uh, for y, we'll substitute in for y. So t squared is equal to y plus 4. t is equal to the square root of y plus 4. Substituting that in to our equation here, we're going to get x is equal to square root of y plus 4 squared plus 4. So we're going to end up with x is equal to y plus 4 plus 4 x is equal to y plus 8, or however you want to mix it up. Um, but this is it. This is our equation and our graphs over there. That's it.